Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. We're going to part 17 and let's play Final Fantasy V Advance. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, we're going to head back to the desert and actually go in this time. Okay, this works for me. Um, which one should I take? Probably this one. Yep, you can get enemy encounters even when you're not moving. Sandbear? That guy looks ugly. I mean, look at him. Looks like he got no eyeballs. Okay, looks like I'm gonna take a fair amount of shots to get him. But luckily I did pick up some water scrolls in case we run into some very difficult fights. They should help out. Um, let's see. Go this way, I suppose. And down? Nope, that's not gonna help. I'm gonna go this way. Ah, here's a couple new enemies. Desert Killer and Sand Boil. Wait, I don't have any ninjas, so I might want to switch something out. That's okay. I'll just use Aqua Breath instead. Yeah, I'm gonna switch Gallop out, and no wait, rather than switch him out, I'll just give him the throw ability if I got it. Let's see, does he have it? Let me check. Nope, he didn't level his ninja class enough for it. That's okay, we'll give it to him now. Throw, and let's see. We don't need first strike because we'll already have that. Um, let's see, uh. What would be good? I'm not gonna use Gaia, that may not help me so much. What would be a good thing to equip? Let me see. Uh, sprint, I suppose. And again, I may not be sprinting so much, but I'll just go with that for now. Put you in the front row. Oops. I can go this way. Uh, but it doesn't look like we can... Oh, never mind. Sometimes it just throws you off. I mean, you have to look at it very carefully in order to see where you're going. Where are my water scrolls? Oh. I forgot to sort them. That's why they're down at the bottom. There's really no point to select a target because they attack everyone anyway. Okay, I'm better sort my items. Um, this. Come on. There, that's why I picked so many of these things up. It makes these fights a lot easier. Oh, Bart's getting a level. Cool. Oh, looks like I see something in my midst. Okay, sand bears, I'll throw away the scrolls for now. Because I can fight them single handedly just fine. Uh, I have to work my ways down a little bit. I'm seeing something. Oh, it's locked. Coming across some ruins. Yeah. What are they for? I say we check it out. It's just a shame you still get enemy encounters here. Looks like some kind of pyramid. But I can't do anything with it. I'll have to come back to it later. In the meantime, we just kill these guys off. Gain some levels, which is a good thing. Probably have to head a little bit more way south. So let's do that. Oh, 
Come on. These guys are really starting to piss me off. But at least you guys are good experience for now. Let's see. How do I work my way around this? Here. Come on! This is starting to become a broken record. How do I exit this place? Well, not that way, that's for sure. Or that way. Looks like I'm just making things worse. Okay, now how do I maneuver around this desert. Wait, wait, I think I figured it out. It could be around here. That cacti formation is very suspicious. There we go! Get out of here! It took a lot of effort, but we made it! Oh, now we're into some classic enemies again. I remember you guys. I managed to steal a Warhammer from you off footage. It's a stronger axe, mind you. Nothing too special. Okay, there's gotta be thing if we can actually move a few inches ah here we go there's a town uh, just in case I better tent because this town looks old I think I can switch you back to a thief go to first strike and put you in the back row. Again. Ah, uh, go in the town of ruin. Guess this is that town of ruin Sid was talking about. Well, apparently it is. There's apparently no town building that's active. Well, good thing I use that tent. Because I don't want to be going to an inn. Huh? That was... King Tycoon? Oh, it went that way. Alright, looks like he's playing a little bit of hide-and-seek. That's okay, I'm pretty good at hide-and-seek, though I developed a fear of heights as a result. Where has he gone off? Let me try this way. I don't think I've been southwest. Well, I don't think we'll be able to do much. Oh, there he is. You couldn't have gone far. Father! P papa What? Well, that was very interesting. Doesn't sound like he cares much. Ow. Oh no, we got separated, didn't we? Ferris! Huh? I knew it! You really are my sister! I'm sorry. I wasn't certain at first. But then I didn't think I should tell you. Sister! Lena! Um, Galif, why are you humping the wall? Uh, where are we? This place is strange. Say, what happened to the old man? Huh? He's not here? We must have gotten separated when we fell.
He'll be okay. He's a tough old cuss. Huh, <laughs> cuss. I'm sure we'll run into him again later. Come on, let's get going. <laughs> He's acting all desperate now. Wow. Now wait one cotton picking minute. That was an awfully quick decision to ditch me. Yikes, uh, sorry. And then we just go back together as if nothing had happened. Hmm. I think I might want to revert you back to a ninja. So I'd like to be able to throw. I have a feeling it'll come in handy. Uh, counter, just in case. Okay, what the hell is this kind of statue? Oh, this is very mechanical, to say the least. What is this? Is that, is that the crystals? No, we're just warping. This looks like some kind of ancient technology just moving us around. Okay, where are you going to take us? No, not under there! Crescent Island? But it did say there was something underneath. I didn't think there was a link here. Look out! Okay, what's this? Uh, I think we should go now. Yeah, like, uh, let's not take our time. Looks like this bridge is crumbling. Well, wow, this, this is weird. Meanwhile... Okay, Sidemid's still got the black purple chocobo. No, don't land it there! Now I gotta catch it again! East, west, home is best. Even if you're a chocobo, huh? Bird should be thrilled! We went above and beyond the Call of Duty! Oh, you guys are so gonna get murdered when I find out about this. Phew, that was close. I suppose that was a warp device. No! Really? After not being used for so long, activating it must have caused an overload. Th that would make sense. Well, what is this place called again? Catap catapult? I mean, it's not a catapult? Oh, a bedroom. Yeah, I'll rest. Oh, well, how convenient. There happens to be four beds. They would do that. This game is so sweet. What's in here? I suppose there's a lot of stuff to check out. Maybe in these pots, perhaps? Um, yeah, I'll push the switch. Carved into the wall. Check the planters in the center room. Huh? Planters? Hmm. Oh, I mean this room? I'm checking! Oh, there's a note. The notepad in the room on the right. Okay, this happens to be some kind of goose chase. Man, you look! Neener, neener, neener! Okay, this is a jerk. Arg, that little... Calm down, Barts. Hey, before you get your pantaloons in a twist, take a look. There's another note. Check the urn. Okay, which urn? There are multiple urns here. Oh, there's a frog. And he just knocked the book over. Go down six and right four, then pull what's there. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Oh, you pull the switch. Okay. I got a shuriken. Another shuriken. And a mini spell. It's good white magic. Cool. So apparently I was supposed to pull and not push. 
Yeah, I'll push that switch. Uh oh. That black chocobo's not even blinking. I was like, eh? Eh, why do I care? Oh, now the door's open. Oh, the epic consecrated circle! Let's go. There's no enemy encounters here. I can count my blessings there. This is... Hey, it's a fire-powered ship! I thought it had sunk! But what's that ship over there? There's another ship? Cool. Propellers on a boat? What's up with that? Sorry, guys. Sid! Mid! Oh! What the? Bards, Lena, Ferris, Galif, what are you guys doing here? We didn't come here because we wanted to, you know. I think that's our line. Where'd you guys come from? We rode the black chocobo back to Crescent Island. Then all of a sudden, a hole opened up beneath us, and we fell. Wait, so we're underneath Crescent Island? Apparently. That explains the fire-powered ship being here. This place must have been built by the ancients. Huh? And this propeller ship? Uh, maybe we sh you should ask Grandpa about that. Huh? Wait, where'd he go? I reckon he went downstairs. Which I'm gonna do too. Hot diggity dang! This is mind blowing! What is? Looks like there's still machinery running. Hey, Sid. Don't bother me, boyo. Okay, fine, I won't then. Tighten this and adjust this. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. And that's the art of intercourse. I mean, fixing a ship. Voila! That should do it. That should do what? <laughs> Excuse me. That should get the ship moving. Wait. A ship with propellers. This could come in our favor. Sid, what is this thing? Isn't it obvious? It's an airship. Amazing. I've only ever seen these in old texts. I can't believe I've got getting to use them in the flesh. Or, er, well, you know what I mean. Oof, what was that? Something's dragging us down! Of course this would be too good to be true. Creeping crowdheads! Some monster's got a death grip on the ship's hull! Oh, and here's our boss, Crayclaw. Now this thing is weak against electric attacks. That is why I made Gallop a ninja. To make use of it. Okay, use Thundara. I don't think we need any blue magic. Never mind! <laughs> well, actually, we didn't need blue magic. Ha! Looks like that overgrown lobster just got served. With cheese biscuits and mashed potatoes. Is it like, what? Cheese biscuits? Looks like damage to the ship was minimal. We can use parts from the fire-powered ship to make the airship good as new. Sid? If you're just gonna thank me, I don't need to hear it. I'll stay here and search for some clues about the Earth Crystal. The skies are yours, kids. Now get out of there. Okay. The evil warlock, X-Death. We must prevent him from returning. Okay, your line. All that's left is the Earth Crystal. Yeah, we still don't know where it is. No point in dawdling. Let's go. Well, isn't it great we can now fly? Not only that, land anywhere we want. Well, anywhere that's landable, of course. What, you can't land on... 
a desert or forest, of course. <laughs> Excuse me. I think I'm gonna stop the video right here, and next part, why don't we go pay Tycoon Castle another visit? See ya, everyone.